Stay tuned to Warp Up, KEXP 90.3 FM, where the music matters. I'm Derek Mazzoni, your DJ and host, and I am stoked beyond belief. Strome in the studio. First time in Seattle. Yes. No, at KXP. the second one. The first time in a radio. On a radio. Seattle. Yeah, on a radio. Yes. And you're a radio veteran. Uh, what does that mean? That means that you, play, you used to work at a radio station. Yeah, but not usually in uh, English-speaking radio. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I want to know more about that. <laughs> Would love to hear some music, please. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go with Papa Ute. Dites-moi d'où il vient, enfin je saurai où je vais Maman dit que lorsqu'on cherche bien, on finit toujours par trouver Elle dit qu'il n'est jamais très loin, qu'il part très souvent travailler Maman dit travailler c'est bien, bien mieux qu'être mal accompagné Pas vrai, où est ton papa Dis-moi où est ton papa Sans même devoir lui parler, c'est ce qui ne va pas Ma sacré papa, dis-moi où es-tu caché ça doit Faire au moins mille fois que j'ai compté mes doigts hey. Où t'es papa, où t'es Où t'es papa, où t'es Où t'es papa, où t'es Où t'es, où t'es, où papa, où t'es Où t'es papa, où t'es Où t'es papa, où t'es Où t'es papa, où t'es Où t'es, où t'es, où papa, où t'es Il y aura bien un jour où on n'y croira plus Un jour ou l'autre on sera tous papa Et d'un jour à l'autre on aura disparu Serons-nous détestables Serons-nous admirables Des géniteurs ou des génies Dites-nous qui donne naissance aux irresponsables Ah, dites-nous qui Tiens, tout le monde sait comment on fait des bébés Mais personne sait comment on fait des papas Monsieur, je sais tout, on aurait hérité C'est ça, faut le sucer de son pouce ou quoi Dites-nous où c'est caché Ça doit faire au moins mille fois qu'on a Fais nos doigts, hey. où t'es papa, où t'es, où t'es papa, où t'es, où t'es papa, où t'es, où t'es, où t'es, où papa, où t'es, où t'es papa, où t'es, où t'es papa, où t'es, où t'es papa, où t'es, où t'es, où t'es, où papa, où t'es. Live on Wop Up on KXP. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I've been tossing and churning like over the last couple of days because there's so many things I want to talk to you about. Huh. But let's start with that song, um, Papa Ute. Tell me a little bit about it. Uh, the question is, uh, what's a good father? <laughs> uh -huh. What's a bad father? <laughs> okay. I think that's the meaning of the song with no answer, unfortunately, or hopefully, I don't know, <laughs> but... Uh, um, yeah, I think when you're a teenager, you think that uh, 
maybe you could be better than your father and you actually uh, used to say to him that he's not perfect but actually um, when I wrote the song I realized that actually I just had to wait to be a father to understand what's mm-hmm. what's about what is about being a father I don't know if sorry for my English but I don't know if you get if no I totally do I okay, totally okay. do I am a father and I ha- I also had an absent father and it's definitely that like okay I don't know what this is really is until you you have one but on that point this these are very deep subjects that aren't often sung about in pop songs mm-hmm. so you're covering a pretty broad range of emotions and experience and um I'd love to know like wh- what's the motivation for that for you where do where like you know you could be just singing about love and good times and bling but and you're having fun and having fun uh I don't know why but it's I, it's just difficult for me uh and it's obvious that actually it's obvious for me to talk about something you know who decided that, that you can't talk about something a bit sad or melancholy or whatever on on a dance track uh, on a pop pop song Mm -hmm. um it's just that yeah i feel that like this and uh because maybe i used to listen to this kind of music uh, because of uh people like uh uh, buena vista social club Mm -hmm. cesaria evora it's like you know those kind of uh dance track but at the same time melancholy tracks and uh, i think that's exactly like how life is you know because uh, uh, you know it's not about only ha- having fun or only about sadness it's just the, the both at the same time at the same time um, and I used to compose like this but but you, it's working because you become a ridiculously successful musician <laughs> thank you and bad and um, That's and a beautiful so compliment thank you and it's and it's just getting better you're in the states right now this is the second time you're on a tour you've got a full roster of amazing places you're going to be in portland and um, then you're going to be in la and club nokia and you're finishing off on the 16th at las vegas the center of the belly of the beast of the united states yeah, yeah. and your music that sense of like happiness and sadness the melancholy i think is going to be received there ridiculously well uh, i hope so <laughs> please thank you i want to i want to uh, i want to talk more but i'd love to hear another song if possible uh, let's uh, play back. I was talking about uh, Cesaria Evora. Let's mm-hmm. talk about her. Uh, this track is a uh, tribute to her. I don't know if... Beautiful. Uh, yeah. No, we, we love Cesaria Evora. She, she's... Um, the first time you played here at the Showbox Market, that was one of the last time places she played. Oh. Uh, barefoot and all. I DJed open for her. It was an amazing experience. No, you don't came. even understand one word. No, it doesn't matter. And it it doesn't matter. You're just crying when she she was singing. This is true. Cesaria Evora. Evora, Evora. Evora, Evora. Evora, Evora. Evora, Evora. Les effluves de rhum dans ta voix Me font tourner la tête Tu me fais danser du bout des doigts Comme tes cigarettes Immobiles comme à ton habitude Mais es-tu devenu muette Ou oh, est-ce à cause des kilomètres Que tu ne me réponds plus Et voilà, et voilà Tu ne m'aimes plus ou quoi Et voilà, et voilà Après tant d'années Et voilà, et voilà Une de perdu, c'est ça, et voilà, et voilà, je te retrouverai, c'est sûr, c'est sûr, ça c'est sûr. Et voilà, et voilà. Souviens-toi de la première fois où nos regards s'étaient croisés, même que ton œil disait merde à l'autre, et surtout à moi, hein, mais pourquoi moi, alors que les autres te trouvaient bien trop laide, peut-être que moi je suis trop bête. Mais je sais t'écouter Et voilà, et voilà Tu ne m'aimes plus ou quoi Et voilà, et voilà Après tant d'années Et voilà, et voilà Une de perdue, c'est ça Et voilà, et voilà Je te retrouverai, c'est sûr C'est sûr, ça c'est sûr Yeah. 
Bravo pour la rue à pied, nué et nué était. Un diva au pied nu restera. Y a vie, Césaria. Et à la mort aussi. Oh brigade, tu es en brigade. A des millions de soldats dans ta patrie. Donc garde à vous, Césaria. Tu nous as tous quand même bien nus. Hein. Tout le monde te croyait disparu. Mais tu es revenu sacré, Césaria. Quelle belle leçon d'humilité. Malgré toutes ces bouteilles de rhum, tous les chemins mènent à la dignité. Et voilà, et voilà. Et voilà, et voilà. Et voilà, et voilà. Et voilà, et voilà. Tu ne m'aimes plus ou quoi? Et voilà, et voilà. Après tant d'années. Et voilà, et voilà. Une de perdue, c'est ça. Et voilà, et voilà. Je te retrouverai, c'est sûr. Oh, soda, soda, didina, cesaria. 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 Oh, soda. Soda di dinia Cesaria, oh soda, soda di dinia Cesaria. Stromae, live on Wop Up and KXP. That was beautiful. Thank you very much. Thank uh, you. Paul, would you introduce the band, please? Uh, so, uh, Manoli Augustinatos. <laughs> He's the Cavaquinho player, guitar player. Uh, yeah, actually, they can they could play every instrument uh, they want. Uh, they just have that crazy talent. Yes, exactly. Uh, so, beautiful. Manoli and Florian Rossi. So, he's... Uh, He's half Italian, half Belgian, and Manoli French. is half Greek, uh, French. I said, well, uh, Belgian, sorry, French. <laughs> yes. Sorry, ma- f- sorry, Florian. <laughs> and, uh, and, Ma- and Manoli is half uh, Greek and uh, Belgian. Okay, and you are half Rwandan, half Belgian. Exactly. I want to, like, I- I've, I've been following your career for a while, as many, but I want to do a little introduction to people that have, might not know you, because you're... Um, you're trying to do something right now that hasn't happened in a very long time, and I don't think it's ever happened in French to get a number one record in the United States. And you could do it because you've not, got you've got the package. So, yeah, so, wood. <laughs> so, but you you um, uh, I'm getting everything from the internet, so it could be lies. So I'm just warning you right now, and I apologize if it's wrong. <laughs> okay. um, but you got started in hip hop. Yes, and that was your first love Correct. in music. Yes, and my first love that I decide to listen to. You know, I choose to listen to. Okay. You know, compared to when you listen, when you're younger and you listen to the music of your parents. Actually, mm-hmm. um, so but it's okay. I'm sorry. Okay, no, no, it's fine. No, it's true. Same, same thing. Um, and now you're living in Brussels. Yes, yeah, still. Okay, still in Brussels. So, but you've actually become a sensation in a French-speaking world, and you're. This is your second record, right? Yes, it is. Okay, so on your second record, you your song becomes the national anthem for the French, I mean, for the Belgian soccer team in the World Cup as they advance. So yes. you're getting this attention for what you do mm-hmm. from all over. You start two clothing lines. One clothing line, you, re- you repeated these like... Yeah, actually, it's just, uh, two different ca- okay. collections, but yeah, one, one clothing line, yes. And then as I dig deeper, um, you have a huge depth. I mean, talking about Cuban Son, Bonifacio Social Club, Congolese Rumba and all that. So that's a lot of stuff there that's going different on. Different influences. Different different influences and, mm-hmm. and, um, and actually able to... So you're somebody who's not from Belgium, came in from a whole other place, and now has become the, the voice of your people in your country what is that like <laughs> but actually yeah, i'm from there I, I cannot say you know i'm half uh, african but i used to say okay i'm 40 percent uh african and 60 percent belgian even if ge- genetically i'm half and half mm-hmm. but you know when you're born and raised in yeah. europe it's difficult to say uh yeah you know i'm i'm from uh, you know i know africa very well you know you, you can't say that but 
Af I know Africa through the prism, the uh, European prism, actually. So it's difficult to say. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, so of course I'm half and half and I, and I know my culture, but not so well as uh, an, a real Rwandan. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, that's pretty funny to be, uh, uh, to don't have, you know, to don't have the, the, the local color, of course. Yeah. I'm just, yeah. Um, and be supported like that and considered as a real Belgian because I'm a real Belgian, actually. I'm a real. So, uh, uh, yeah, that's just history and uh, it's important to live with with it. And, uh, yeah, that's just the history and uh, uh, that's what's really, that's our next step of, our planet, I, I guess. I uh, totally agree, and that was the, that was my next point: is that, mm -hmm. that the conversation I've had with other people about you is that you're actually representing the entire human experience. I, that's a big thing to say, and I'm sorry to just suddenly <laughs> heave that Thank on you. you. I understand the compliment. Um, Thank you. <laughs> but but it's like this is Africa, and this is Europe, and this is the the 21st yeah. century, mm -hmm. and video, and fashion, and in song. So thank and you America for being here. as well, and America, and South America as well, and maybe Asia. I don't know very well the music in Asia, but. I'm looking forward to discover everything and put some influences in my music. I think I think you're going to do it, and I look forward to just following your success more and more. Thank you. Would love to hear some more music, please. Uh, let's talk about uh, somebody uh, drunk. Okay, <laughs> we know that. Seattle knows. Drunk. Actually, it's we more about that. loneliness. The track is more about loneliness, and uh, it's called uh, "Formidable" because the word exists in English. Yes, I discovered. Yeah, uh, so "formidable." <laughs> Formidable, formidable Tu étais formidable, j'étais formidable Nous étions formidables Formidable Tu étais formidable, j'étais formidable Nous étions formidables Oh bébé Oups, mademoiselle, je veux pas vous draguer Promis juré, je suis célibataire Et depuis hier, putain, je peux pas faire d'enfant Et bon, c'est pas, hé, hey, reviens, cinq minutes, quoi Je t'ai pas insulté, je suis poli pour toi Et un peu fort bourré Mais pour les mecs comme moi, ça vaut autre chose à faire hein. M'auriez vu hier, j'étais formidable Formidable tu étais formidable, j'étais formidable Nous étions formidables Formidable Tu étais formidable, j'étais formidable Nous étions formidables Hé hey Tu t'es regardé Tu te crois beau parce que tu t'es marié Tu sais qu'un anneau mec T'emballe pas, elle va te larguer comme elles le font chaque fois. Et puis l'autre fille, tu lui en as parlé. Si tu veux, je lui dis, comme ça c'est réglé. Et au petit aussi, enfin, si vous en avez, ha, attends trois ans, sept ans, et là vous verrez si c'est formidable. Formidable. Tu étais formidable, j'étais formidable. Nous étions formidables Formidables Tu étais formidable, j'étais formidable Nous étions formidables Oh petite, oh pardon, petit Tu sais dans la vie, il n'y a ni méchant ni gentil Si maman est chiante, ce qu'elle a peur d'être mamie Si papa trompe maman c'est parce que maman vieillit, tiens, pourquoi t'es tout rouge bah Reviens, gamma, et qu'est-ce que vous avez tous à me regarder comme un singe, vous Ah oui, vous êtes ça, vous Bande de macaques, donnez-moi un bébé singe, il sera formidable Formidable Tu étais formidable, j'étais formidable Nous étions formidables Formidable Tu étais formidable, j'étais formidable Nous 
étions formidables. Strome, live on Wop Up. KXP. <laughs> that was great. You're in character. <laughs> Perfect. And it's a beautiful video. And it caused Thank you. quite a sensation, actually. Thank you so much. Tell me a little bit about your, your thought process on videos, which are just as important as the, as the recordings right now. Um, uh, actually, when I was co composing the track uh, Formidable uh, in my home studio alone, um, it was obvious for me. Fin, yeah, I just wanted to, to, to play to act, to uh, um, fake that I was drunk in the street. Um, and I uh, asked him, the director, Jérôme Guillaume, uh, and he helped me and directed me to do the, the good thing. Never be too much or mm -hmm. too less. Uh, um, Not over overdo so, it. Yeah. And we worked a lot. Uh, and yeah, we did just uh, this hidden camera in the street in um, Louise uh, Square on, in Brussels um, and actually people was just recognizing me but at the same time ignoring me uh, taking pictures of me uh, yeah it was just a definition of uh, humanism mm -hmm. what we are human being we could be just voyeurist uh, ignorant or uh, um, help, helpful not helpful but actually uh, give a hand so uh, I, we we just had all those different behaviors uh, in this street, and I was pretty surprised to see how we we are good. Uh, you, human being is really good. We are so wow. good and really nice. <laughs> that's good. That's wonderful. <laughs> um, I did. That's a great learning process. But let me let's talk about the United States right now for a second, because you're here right now. You're doing this tour, and you're starting to work with some pretty big names, um, Lord uh, da, 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 Diplo, Kanye West, Gra yeah. old school Grace Jones, Will I Am. What's that like for you to, to um, are you feeling like I'm up here, I'm, you know, I'm just there, or is it like this, this process of like, okay, are they treating me like I'm this unique little boutique thing? <laughs> is uh, it collaborative or is it more? Yes, it is. Uh, it depends, actually. Uh, sometimes you... you I think it's uh, it has to be genuine and uh, for example the, the track Meltdown for the the soundtrack of uh, of uh, Mocking Jay Mocking Jay I'm sorry yes okay. <laughs> um, it was it, it, she decided to, to to call my manager mm -hmm. and uh, I was surprised and I sent two tracks one uh, called Merci on my album uh, and another one a new composition that you don't know, but uh, and she decided to to choose the the one of, of my album, and she just uh, yeah, and it was really interesting to see how it was important to have my advices, my uh, opinion mm -hmm. for the different collaborations uh, she wanted to have uh, with Pushati, with Aim, with uh, all those beautiful uh, performers, singers, and uh, songwriters. So, um, and so, yeah, sometimes it could be. Uh, the, 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 I think the danger is uh, to do something too uh, artificial mm -hmm. and just to do for doing this, you know, yep. because you yeah. have to. And uh, and all those co collaboration was just genuine and, and uh, I'm happy of it. So uh, I'm really thankful to all those uh, beautiful singers. Wonderful. So this this is the this is the dilemma that often happens is that like you come in and then you get this pressure to stop being you and become more... Yeah. American, American. That's the um, yeah, that, but it's good. I th I think it's good. You have to integrate yourself. I mm -hmm. don't know if it's uh, so. It, it's important to, to do it, but uh, not in the wrong way. Yeah. Uh, and uh, yeah, I think just the easiest way, of course, is just you know do this kind of uh, uh, translation, mm -hmm. easy translation, and and I don't think so. I, I'm sure that American people could feel. And can feel the emotion, the feelings, the sincere feelings. Yeah. And if I try to just imitate an American singer, they will they will directly feel it. And oh, yeah, I'm that's sure like that it's yeah, it's more interesting to sing in your own language, which is more sincere, I I, I guess. So, I totally agree. Okay. And I, you've got everything. You've got the package down. I think I think you're going to to um, 
be able to stand out under the pressure, and it is a pressure cooker. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I would love to hear some more music, please. Uh, then, the last, uh, the last song is a uh, cappella version of uh, Tous les Mêmes, which is a song about love, but not the cliché and the, uh, uh, the positive way of love. Okay. There is also a negative way, which is interesting and necessary. Uh, yeah, and yeah, that's just uh, a ridiculous man and a ridiculous woman, but they are just beautiful. Perfect. <laughs> Vous les hommes êtes tous les mêmes Macho Mechi ou bande de Mori est infidèle Si prévisible, non je ne suis pas certaine que tu le mérites, avez de la chance qu'on vous aime. Dis-moi merci, rendez-vous, rendez-vous, rendez-vous au prochain règlement. Rendez-vous, rendez-vous, rendez-vous sur ma prochaine règle. Pom 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 mais pour les élever, il y aura des absents Lorsque je ne serai plus belle Ou du moins au naturel Arrête, je sais que tu mens Il n'y a que quête mosque qui est éternel Moche ou belle, c'est jamais bon Bête ou belle, c'est jamais bon Belle ou moi, c'est jamais bon Moi ou elle, c'est jamais bon Rendez-vous, rendez-vous, rendez-vous au prochain règlement. Rendez-vous, rendez-vous, rendez-vous sur ma prochaine rêve. Pom 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 tous les mêmes, tous les mêmes, tous les mêmes, et y en a marre. Oui, tous les mêmes, tous les mêmes, tous les mêmes, et y en a marre. Oui, tous les mêmes, tous les mêmes, tous les mêmes, et y en a marre. Oui, tous les mêmes, tous les mêmes, tous les mêmes, et y en a marre. You got it into Warp Up KXP, Stromae, live in the studio. That was ridiculously, amazingly good. Thank you very much. Thank I you. I love the way you say that. <laughs> I'm just, uh, yeah. I'm just, um, I'm like, I'd pro there probably is no French That's translation. That's good balance. Ridiculously amazing. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. It's just, you know, <laughs> you know, wonderful magic. It's like, what's going to happen? Thank you. That very was much. wonderful. Please come back again. Thank you to Florian and Marie. Oh, uh, and thank you. Thank you for having us. Please, please, please. Thank you. This was awesome. You guys are phenomenal. Everything, the entire package, down to a T, and really wonderful musicians. Um, and you have um, sold out shows. And it's yes. thank you for being here, and thank, thank you, you for sharing your music, and thank you for sharing everything that you do. No, no, thank you for having us, and uh, yeah, see you soon. I Absolutely. Hope. Thank you so much, and bye-bye. Uh, bye-bye. Whoop up, KXP, 90.3 Seattle, where the music matters. Discover new music at listenerpoweredkexp.org.